God dang it, Bob Pancakes! More choices mean yell at. How dare you? I am pregnant and I don't want to be with you. It's Megan and today we're back on my channel with making Monica before we get into it I wanted to let you guys know I stream five times a week on twitch starting on May 23rd Bing over here check out the schedule and also follow me on Twitter to be notified about just really important life updates when I'm gone it means I'm gonna be posting pictures of the Caribbean together uh, a lot of fun stuff is gonna be over on Twitter and twitch so make sure you guys follow that check it out there will be a link in the comments and in the description open the description if you never have before there's a lot of really interesting things there um, I also wanted to let you guys know that if you subscribe and hit the bell you'll become part of the hashtag notification squad and that's exciting and you guys can write about it and you can always be like the first to comment because I know a lot of people like that so let me know if you guys are part of the notification squad let me know if you followed me on twitch and I will love your comment I'll give it a heart I'll respond okay let's get into the episode so guys today in making Monica we have just woken up from messing around with Christian if you guys remember the last episode see he is still here um I think I was gonna make us some food but I have to kind of clean out the spoiled food in the fridge first because that is disgusting so we can also serve breakfast let's serve eggs and toast for me and Christian to eat I think Monica actually has work like oh right now so we actually don't have time to make any food um uh, so I guess we'll just leave that there awkward so she's off Christian is staying over he's hanging out um, I'm actually glad Monica was able to make it to work because she actually has been struggling to balance everything, you know? Um, but with $56 in their pocket, you know, life is looking up. Let's see if we can tickle the ivories, just work on our piano skill a little bit um, before we have to head into school in about an hour. You know, you gotta balance your dreams and you gotta balance your work life, all that stuff. School, work, dreams, it's all gotta go hand in hand. Oh shoot, we're late for school, we're late! Okay, it's okay, Monica, head to school. We're so angry. Why are we so angry? Let's try to calm down a little bit because we want invite Christian over we want to see if he wants to move in with us although there is like no move in action uh, I'll have to merge the households manually oh speaking of him he's right here more choices friendly bright and day you know um ask about woohoo because they did woohoo so let's ask if it was any good you know that's what we're gonna use that action for hopefully we can calm down from being so enraged I don't want to have a heart attack or something crazy like that um two more hours and we're good we're good we're good Wait, eh, zero minutes. I guess we're still stuck there, but we are so drained. We're feeling very tired. I hate that. I hate it when my son is feeling tired. Um, compliment appearance, more choices, friendly, uh, ask about day, um, friendly, boast about messing around because we did mess around together. You know, that's pretty, a pretty big deal, you know? Um, more choices, compliment outfit, more choices, friendly, bright and day. Let's get him, let's get him in the house, right? Is this our social skill we're working on here? If so, that'd be nice. We can get a little bit more social, follow our dreams and such. Uh, let's play with emotion. We are feeling really tired though, so I think we need to take a nap soon because I don't want to be too exhausted, you know? You got to pace yourself with these types of things. But I want to get to the next level of skill there. Uh, we are now piano level five which is good. I don't know what level we have to be to write songs, but I feel like it's got to be level six or else that wouldn't be in the same like aspiration uh, bracket. You know what I mean? So we still have a bit to make that happen because you know, we're gonna be we're gonna be a teenager in a while. Let's uh, head to sleep and then she's gonna have to do her homework. I wonder if Christian did his homework. Not that it's any of my business, <laughs> but we are gonna go to sleep now. Oh gosh, we really have to use the restroom. Um, we can use and we could take a pregnancy test. So we're gonna take a pregnancy test, I guess. Uh, see what happens there. He's in the restroom. Hello. Mm, you know, nothing cool happening. Uh, we also have to eat. Oh gross, this got all nasty. Let's clean this up. Eating for two, guys. Monica has gotten pregnant. Pregante. As a teenager, her life just got a lot more difficult. Um, it is currently midnight, like 12 a.m. So I think we're gonna have to call Christian over and tell him the news in the morning um, after school. I know a lot of you guys wanted this path for Monica. Um, I thought it would be interesting. So here we are. Oh my gosh, uh, it's a tough one. It's gonna be actually really hard because <laughs> it's already really hard. I want to make sure we get our homework done. We cannot let our grades slip. Like we can even, I think, do this project um, right here. We can work on it carefully. That'll help our responsibility skill. You know, I don't want to fall out of the any of the responsibility or manners traits. Uh, whenever I have this mod installed for like the MC Command Center, I turn it off most of the time when I'm playing. Sometimes I keep it on for thumbnails, but I can't see any of these 
items so I it's difficult I just want to make sure you know we're all doing everything we need to do oh my gosh she was thinking about diapers how sad um with six hundred dollars to our name we really do not have a leg to stand on here <laughs> We've worked in one hour. Oh, lordy, lordy. Okay, so there we go. At least we finished our homework. Let's go ahead and try to get a promotion at work because we do have an excellent work record. Um, and I think that'll be good. We do smell though. I mean, maybe we'll go wash our hands at work a few times. Okay, so let's watch. Let's see if we get a promotion because we're only working like two hours. <gasps> yes, I think that we are able to get a promotion. Scrub clean. Work hard. Promoted to bean blender. We now make 41 simoleons an hour. We just got a bonus of like 200 simoleons. Um, oh gosh, yeah, we make an additional 13 simoleons an hour. She'll still receive the following bonus that much. Her next shift is at 5 a.m. So the hours don't change or anything like that. Um, and we have we have school soon. So let's work on this carefully for a little bit. Just work on, you know, our responsibility, getting this done. Because I think this will also work as um, extra credit. Because look at this, guys. Our school average has gone down. We are about to no longer be an A student. Not good. But we did our homework. We're going to school in a good mood today. So we should be totally fine. I get so annoyed. I can't ever hold this up. So there's a glitch in my game. What the heck? Our toilet's broken. We're going to have to fix that as soon as we get home. Okay, uh, let's repair this. We can mop this up and then let's work carefully. It is the weekend. So, you know, we have a while to figure, figure things out. We can work on our skills. We can do yoga. We can do things that truly make us happy. Um, and then we can invite Christian over and let him know the news, uh, you know, that we're like in this together. <laughs> Hopefully he can give us like a promise ring or something like that to help us raise this baby. Um, hey, I was thinking about checking out the city today. Can I use your place to get ready? I mean, I guess if you would like. Oh, he's gonna work out the pro- no. I thought he's gonna work on that project with us. Friendly, let's um, ask about his day. More choices, friendly, Brighton day. Which one of these interactions would be the closest to telling him about the news? Um, A deep conversation. We are gonna have a deep conversation with him to tell him about the baby. Um, Oh my gosh, look how tense and stuff we are. We need to take a shower. We need to use the restroom. Um, We need to have fun. Yeah, good luck now. Uh, and we need to sleep. Gosh, there's so much we need to do. Oh, if we woohoo, will that uh, will that help our fun? Probably not our bladder problems though. Hey, let's stop working on this project for a second and let's take care of our needs. Okay, so we're gonna have fun because I think that this is gonna have the fun go all the way up. It usually does. Life hacks, guys. But oh my gosh, everything else is in such poor condition. So let's take a shower, use the restroom. Probably should have done the other order in case she pees herself as she comes out of the restroom. And now our shower is so dirty. We can probably clean it up. Uh, more choices, clean out spoiled food, have quick meal. Let's just have a ham and cheese sandwich for right now. We don't have a lot of time um, to waste. Okay, and then here we are going to sleep at 9 p.m., a reasonable hour of the day so that we can spend all Saturday working on things we actually want to work on, like um, our school project and also the piano. So let's go to sleep. Oh, we can't. Okay. Um, dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. Pound on door. I'm not dealing with this penny. We are extremely exhausted. That'll be enough. I think she'll stop. Good night. We're just gonna let her sleep now. Oh my gosh. The gnomes came and fixed everything at night. That is awesome. So we got a full night's sleep uh, in an alarmingly short amount of time. Let's mop this up. It is what? 4 a.m.? Oh my gosh, guys. We're showing that baby bump. Let's uh, keep on working on this carefully. I want to make sure we're able to finish it up before the baby gets here. I mean, I'm sure we will finish it before the baby gets here, but you just never know. So I think we're going to have to get Christian to move in um, and help pulling some weight because this apartment is definitely not big enough for a baby and <laughs> ourselves. Did we pull up our... Okay, we did pull up our GPA a little bit. I want to make sure that we fully get that covered right here. Right? Um... Extra credit's been awarded. We can launch it. Must be outside. So let's put this in our inventory. Maybe that'll be fun to do later. Oh my gosh, look at her. She's like, I think I've made a mistake. Okay, so let's clean out spoiled food. Is she holding gross food in her pocket? I guess she was. Um, more choices. I want to change her outfit and did not her underwear <laughs> into her everyday clothing. And it is currently 7 a.m. So soon uh, we will be ready. 
to invite Christian over to let him know the news. Instead, let's uh, practice the piano right now. See if we can get up where we need to be. Oh, we need to reach level two of the mixology skill for our work to get a promotion. Where does this job even lead to? This barista job? Are we supposed to just do it all through our whole teenage years? I am a little confused. What? She just used the restroom and it didn't work at all. So confused. <laughs> okay, 9 a.m. Guys, it's almost time. Oh no, please don't tell me rent is due. Not yet. Not quite yet. But guys, overall, Monica's feeling really happy. So I'm really happy for her. You know, we're gonna use the restroom and then I think we're gonna invite Christian over. Uh, more choices, invite to hang out on current lot. Hopefully he just comes up into the apartment and not some rogue area in the city. <laughs> That would be nice because I know sometimes it gets weird. All right, good guys. We are feeling great. We're calling him on the toilet. <gasps> oh my gosh. Okay, so let's have another deep conversation with him and ask him to move in. Friendly because I don't think we can do it here. So we kind of have to fake it all. Deep conversation. This is us asking him to move in. Hey, listen, um, I really think it's in our best interest if you move in and hate, help take care of this baby, this little baby bump here. Hey, listen, what do you think about this? Invite to feel the baby we can even do. Like, hey, I assure you this is a good choice for us. It looks like he's agreeing. Like, yes, we need to move in. We need to uh, really acknowledge the fact that this is a ordeal. Aw, okay. So we are going to get Christian moved in. We will be right back. Okay, and we're back and Christian has moved in. He brought, we had like $900 and now we have uh, 1,700. So he brought us a, like a good amount of money. Oh my gosh, we can propose as a teenager. Let's share the big news. Uh, I guess I never actually did that, but I thought I did. Uh, ask about day, hey honey, we're in this together forever, right? The big news. He didn't seem excited to hear about that. Oh no. Let's go inside. We're in a pretty good mood. I don't want to waste this. Let's play on the piano. And I was thinking about what Christian would be good at and I was thinking he'd make a good writer. So I'm deleting this whole desk right here. BB.move. BB.move objects on. Okay, so let's put this over here because I do want to get us a nice little uh, desk and chair set. Uh, something cute, but something that's not too expensive because uh, hmm, that's kind of expensive. This one's a kind of a space saver, but I don't like it too much. This one's nice, uh, you know, it's $250, so it's not badly priced either. Uh, let's see if we can get something that matches that. Like, I do like this chair. Does it come in a darker color? Yes, it does. Um, and then let's go ahead and grab a computer because I thought Christian would make a really good writer. Like maybe he can help write songs uh, for Monica. So let's go over here and we can have him write, uh, just practice writing because I want him to work on his skills too. I need everybody to work on skills um, just because we barely get time to do any of this stuff and I think this would be a really good way to express ourselves. So we are very inspired. We are writing and we are working together. This is actually a very lovely scene. I love this very much. <laughs> so Christian acquired the writing skill. He's working on that. Uh, Monica actually also needs to work on the mixology skill. Um, somehow, somewhere. <laughs> Play with emotion. Wait, I want, I need to see. You can do your homework in a second. I just need to see if this is gonna give us what we need to do to write songs. Uh, we can now serenade. Okay, I'm gonna have to Google search this. Wow, okay. You actually have to be level eight to write songs. So, oh my gosh, we could serenade Christian too. That is so sweet. Um, let's keep on practicing. I, I know she doesn't really like practicing, but it's what we're gonna need to do if we ever want to be good enough to write songs. Um, to make money. Oh, and Christian is level two of the writing skill now, so we can actually have him start writing some books, some children's books, uh, cause you know, we're really gonna have to get into it, guys, now. It's not, no time to fret. You know, we are gonna have a baby soon. We have to prepare for this baby. We have a thousand nine hundred, a thousand five hundred dollars to our name, which reminds me, I actually wanna grab Christian a job, um, find a job. I think working in manual labor will help him. I don't know which type of skills he would need, or a babysitter, maybe that'll prep him. But manual labor makes the most, even though it only works on the weekends. I don't know what a really good uh, balance would be. This is four hours, retail employee, this is four hours. Uh, oh, actually this one might be good. So we will have him work in retail, um, and we will see if that gets him really anywhere good. You know, he's working four days, so that kind of sucks, because I think the baby will be born before then, because I know that the baby, it only takes three days. We are gonna be in our third trimester in eight hours. Oh my gosh, we are actually gonna probably have the baby next episode. I was nowhere near prepared for this. <gasps> the romance festival's in town. Wouldn't it be so romantic if we could go together? Oh, it's happening in this neighborhood. Awesome. So it is about to go down, guys. Let's check it out. 
no, I don't want to check it out with you. I'm going to check it out with Christian. Uh, it does not look like it is completely set up yet. So I guess we'll just let it get a little bit no darker outside. Um, and we are almost to level seven of the piano skill, which is good. You can do anything you set your mind to. Christian, how's the book coming? He's feeling tense from working too hard and writing too much. I get that. Play some Blick Block, I guess, because he's feeling tense from writing a lot. Writer's block, you know, from writing. Shout for words, don't do that. Don't do that. Oh my God, he did it anyway. <laughs> oh my gosh, I don't want him to shout forbidden words. Maybe we have to go try to calm down, take a shower, uh, try to calm down, try to calm down. Maybe that'll all be good. And we are, oh my gosh, Monica also really sees the restroom. She has to sleep. She has to do all this stuff. What about the romance festival, Monica? Okay, so Monica's been sleeping. Um, Christian is using the restroom, but I think that they're probably ready. Morning sickness, it is 9 p.m. Uh, let's outfit, change outfit into, um, Maybe something cute to wear to the romance festival? Our little formal outfit? No, oh, this is cute, right? Yeah, let's go on to the romance festival. It's right downstairs, right? Oh, she's going through a phase? No. Okay, so let's um come here. Wait, let's first, gotta come up here. We gotta add Christian to our group. Uh, more choices, actions, add to group. Put the Sims together. We can come downstairs now and we can have them drink tea together. Do romantic things together, guys, please. Can you even have tea if you're pregnant? I don't think you should, because I think it has caffeine in it. Oh my gosh, look how fancy we look. Oh my god, and there's pho here. Can we eat these people's foods? I'm just gonna eat these people's foods, because they left it here, you know, no problem. We're hungry, right? I'm hungry in real life. I would eat it if I saw it completely untouched there. Um, and then we get more choices. Romance, blow a kiss. You know, we're feeling real flirty from all this stuff, but like we're filled with like unpleasant surroundings. I guess there's like trash near us or something, but oh good, it's just been overridden by being really flirty. So uh, more choices, let's go like kiss him and stuff. Throw petals, all this stuff, all this jazz, right? We've eaten, you know, we've drank in the tea, we're feeling it. Let's go, let's go, you know, do some stuff. Oh, he didn't like that. He didn't like that. He didn't, why didn't he like it? She's like, whoopsie daisies. Okay, I'm sorry, Christian. Maybe let's uh, go somewhere romantic together. Like, go here together. What if we just got married? Fantasize about weddings. Oh my gosh, so cute. I didn't realize fantasizing was just going, uh-huh, uh-huh. Where's Christian at? He's supposed to, oh, he did come here with us. More choices, romance, let's be enticing. Wait, don't leave. I need the scenic area for the thumbnail. <laughs> gosh, we are looking mighty pregnant. Ooh, now we're sitting down, more choices. Romance, attempt to seduce, joke about getting together. Heat of the moment proposal. Oh my gosh, that'd be crazy. Uh, let's blow a kiss. You know, we're feeling a little flirty. Bob Pancakes, you go away, please. Why is Bob Pancakes here? Be greeted, you go away. Don't talk to us, don't talk to us, don't talk to us, don't talk to us. Do not talk to us, Bob Pancakes. We're feeling flirty, but it's not for you. It's for our boyfriend, okay? Okay. Oh my gosh. Drifting love from jealousy. God dang it, Bob Pancake. More choices mean. Yell at. How dare you? How dare you? I am pregnant and I don't want to be with you. No, no. Where are you going home? Where's Christian at? Let's go over here. Let's more choices of friendly. Uh, throw petals. I don't think he'll like that. <laughs> Declare heat of the moment passion. Um, joke about getting together, even though we are together. Mention flirty festival vibes. He just really doesn't like the petals, guys. Our love is very important to me. Romance, crest cheek. Please understand. Aw, I just don't want him to, to drift away from us. I'm taking all these screenshots, you know, memory books, guys. Um, let's see if we can invite him to feel the baby, you know, remind him, friendly. Wait, where'd he go? Do you want to feel the baby? Invite to feel baby. Is he in line for food right now? Aw, and I don't want him to feel very sad. I feel bad that he feels so sad. Uh, maybe he can like, I don't know, more choices, friendly, ask for advice, you know, like, hey, I'm not feeling too good about this. What should I do? And then maybe that'll help, you know? Does it make him feel better? 22 hours of being upset. Wow, that sucks. <laughs> okay, so I think everybody should just go home. We had a fun time at the festival, but overall, like, I think we just need to go home, recoup, you know, uh, that is the end. Oh my gosh. It's already Sunday at 2 a.m., so basically our Saturday is about to happen. Um, we got to get Monica right on track. You know, she's a little hungry, so let's have her uh, more cook. Uh, can she not cook anything? Oh, she can. Okay. So let's have her cook some grilled cheese, some family sizes. Let's have uh, Christian come over here. He can clean the sink, and then he can um, give himself some pep talks because he's feeling very sad, and that makes me sad. So what is he doing? Oh, I thought he was buying food downstairs, but no, Monica's making food. And, you know, they're going to be okay, guys. I 
know that there was, you know, drifting love with Bob Pancakes and stuff like that. Um, but I think Christian's gonna be feeling better soon, you know, within the matter of a few hours. Uh, we gotta make sure that everybody does their homework, you know, because although we are pregnancy teens, oh god, we're giving birth in who knows how long. This is probably a good place to end the episode because to give birth and all that in one episode. Guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to hit the like button, subscribe button, subscribe button. Check out Twitch. It's in the comments five times a week starting May 23rd. Um, I appreciate you guys so, so much. Hashtag stay peachy and I will talk to you guys next time. Bye! <laughs>